Now then guys, how you doing? Back on the road again. Alright, I'm dressed up this time. I've got my hat on, I've got my little bit of a ginger wig. Alright, do you know why? Because we're off right at the top, up to that there Scotland, over the hills and far away. Boom, boom. You've been telling us to go up there and try it out, right? So we thought, do you know what? Let's give it a crack. So we're in the car, we're on the road, right? We've heard of this, this place called West East Spice. Apparently they do this big, massive box. All right, so we're going to try that out. Bit of iron brew, bit of iron brew. Can't go to Scotland and not get iron brew. All right, so we're going to go up there, try a bit of iron brew. Try this box out at uh, West East Spice. I'll let you know how it is. Let's go, Scotland, here we come. Boom, boom, ba -da -ba -da boo So we're here, we've arrived, we've arrived at East West Spice, alright, we've heard about this place, right, it, it's been on social media before, it's been in newspaper a couple of years ago for this big munch box what they do, basically they're going to deep fry a load of gear, chuck it in this box and I'm going to sample it, so if my waistline can handle it, let's go and have a look. Now then mate, you alright? Alright, okay, okay. Not bad mate, not bad, so I've heard about this uh, big munch box that you do. The family country box. Yes, yeah. family country box. Can I order one of them, please? Okay. So is it big then? Is no. it is it a big box full of stuff? It's a big box. It's got 12 in pizza box. Right. That's a box. I will fill with the chips. Yeah. With the fish, sausages, hamburger, pizza crunch. Yeah. And fritter, chicken nugget and onion ring. My God. And with the two little bottle of juice as well. Right, lovely. Thank you very much. And how much is that, sir? It's thirteen pound. Thirteen pound. There you go, mate. Thank you. Oh, I can't wait for this, guys. Nice bit of old-fashioned chip shop fat going to be in this box for me today. Thank you very much, sir. I'll just wait outside, mate. Will you just give us a okay, shout when it's ready, yeah? Lovely, thank you very much. All nice fresh ingredients in here, look. Making a few curries. We've got it all going on like, yeah? It's going on like Donkey Kong. Come on, let's go outside. It's a bit warm in here. What's in here then, mate? Chips in the bottom. Half pizza crunch, a single fish, double sausage, double hamburger, chicken nuggets, and onion rings, and you get a two litre bottle of juice. Spot on. Thank you. Cheers, mate. Thank you very much. Thank you, guys. Right, guys. So I've been to West Meets East. All right, spice, spice up your life. I've got to be honest with you. It wasn't like seeing spice girls. That didn't spice up my life in there. All right. For one, well, it was a bit hard to understand these guys. I mean, it's hard to understand me sometimes, but this guy with hat on, my God, <laughs> he nearly cracked a rib on me, making me laugh. So, they've done me this famous crunch box, fat box, whatever you want to call it. He's given me a bottle of their finest juice, as he calls it. All right, so, I'm sat on a bit of a slant here, so if I roll down into this beautiful lake with floating crisp packets, please bear with me. All right, so, let's have a look. Whoosh, and it hits you. <laughs> Straight in face, right? Pure smell of grease fat. You know, this is going. This isn't just going to put a little bit on my hips. This is going to. I might have to be lifted out by a crane if I eat all this. Right, so let's dig in. So let's try a chip first off. I'm not gonna lie, guys. You can probably still see, but. The chip is raw. All right, it's it's not even cooked. It's still a bit raw, and it's got a, an awful aftertaste. And I believe that's due to the the substance they call dry white that they put in the potatoes to keep them from going black. It's still covered in it, so it's giving quite a bit of a nasty flavour. So the chips aren't really for me. 
So. This is a piece of fish, with the looks of it. Oh, Jesus. As you would expect, absolutely dripping and swimming in grease. Let's give it a go. It's not a bad piece of fish. Not a bad piece of fish at all. Onion ring. Feels a bit soggy to be honest. Deep onion ring, bit soggy. Probably been sat there for a while. These look to be chicken nuggets. Oh my god. Yep, chicken nugget. This whole box here guys. Obviously these are to, the idea of these is, is to feed a family for 13 quid. Alright, so I know just looking at that price tag it's not going to be the best ingredients on the block. Alright. So here we've got deep fried burgers. Oh my god, I don't... <laughs> if I'm honest with you, right, I'll be totally honest now on this review. I've just cracked this one open. I don't even know if I, if I even want to put this in my mouth. I mean, <laughs> it doesn't look... But I mean, I'll give it a go. It might be the best tasting thing since sliced bread, but... Some of this finest juice that this is absolutely cracking me down. This sorry, guys, I don't like to spit it out, but oh, so glad I got a bottle of that stuff. That burger, oh, that's not for me. I mean, if I'm honest with you, I wouldn't even give that to my dog. I mean, I don't know what the heck. I mean, the only the only coloured meat I've seen like that is a pepper army, and that's about it. A sausage. So, two beautiful sausages. All right, smells all right, feels all right, like a sausage. I know it's not going to be the top quality gear, but that sausage is a bit. Ooh. So this is this is what sort of grabbed my attention. Now this is what they, they call up here a pizza crunch. So basically, they've been to Tasda, they've got cheapest pizza on shelf, dipped it in a bit of batter, banged it in fryer. My God. To be honest with you guys, I'm struggling with this one. Right guys, so rating time. I mean, I'm not being funny. That piece of fish, you know, you're probably better off dragging one out of this pond that's hiding me here. Yeah? The sausage, it's a battered sausage, right? I don't know about you, but when I go to a fish shop and I take batter off, it's a nice golden colour. That looks like it needs to go on holiday abroad, that, and get a bit of a tan. Not being funny, looks like a bleeding dead finger. Alright, I mean the burger. Let's, let's crack this burger open here. Oh my god. What is that? I mean, this one looks like it's got bleeding warts. Get that crap down at clinic. Look, look at the state of this. Bits of fat, bits of gristle. The pizza, like I said, I mean, it's just the cheap as the pizza. But watch this, watch. Look, look, you can see why people want this. Look, watch this. Look, watch it. It's dripping down here. Look off my fingers. It's just oozing with absolute crap. Ugh, horrible. Cheeky nuggets. If I threw them out a window, they'd probably break it. Some of eating, guys. Let's give it... Let, let's give it a one for being genius and trying to feed a family. All right? And... and, and We'll give it two points for the beautiful bottle of juice. As far as everything else goes, even my mates here on Pump Ducks, they've stayed away. I don't think they're right bothered about this. Alright, so, tell us what you think. If you're into this kind of thing, this is what you like, alright? 
if you've been to this place and you've tried it, let us know what you think, let us know your comments, alright, again, this is my opinion, alright, it's just, it's not for me, we've got dead fingers, wart infested burgers, we've got something that resembles a bit of fish, I mean, tell birds I'd be kicking off with that, right, comment, share it, if you've been, let us know what you all think, if you want to brave it, come down and have a go, alright, but yeah, We'll see you next time, ain't my takeaway. Also guys, as well, all right, we know these are popular in Scotland now, all right, and to be honest, I think these guys put them up map. How this crap got up map is beyond me, but I know other places around the country now are starting to do all these kind of things. If you've got some near you and I think they're worth a try, let us know, all right, send us some pictures in, put them on group, show us what it's all about, all right, see you next time.